Hey y'all, I'm going to talk about the storm and the recovery effort. So let's get started. I want to start by bringing you some of the striking images that have come out of North Carolina, Georgia, South Carolina, Virginia, and Tennessee. question that I have is, where's the government? Where's FEMA? Where's the Red Cross? We haven't seen FEMA. We haven't seen Red Cross. We haven't seen Hearts with Hands. We've seen no agencies come through here. This is like what you see on television from Cat 5 hurricanes. Our town is gone, virtually. That's our town is just gone. As Secretary Alejandro Mayork is sounding the alarm on FEMA funding right after the devastation of Hurricane Helene. Listen. We are meeting the immediate needs uh, with the money that we have. We are expecting another hurricane hitting. Uh, we do not have the funds. FEMA does not have the funds to make it through the season. This all comes as the Biden-Harris administration spent over a billion dollars from a FEMA program on services for migrants. I'm sad to say that we're not getting any response from the federal government. And it breaks my heart that they're spending a billion dollars on housing and education and medical on illegal aliens. And the American people are suffering. Or is there something more nefarious here? I mean, let's face it, this area is generally more Republican than Democrat voters. I mean, is this some kind of conspiracy? I'd like to think that we wouldn't have a federal government that would do something like this. But the way the government has been acting, especially the last three and a half, four years, I wouldn't put anything past it. What do you think? Give me your impressions. And we'll see you next time. Deuces.